don't have to kill people who kill people. You know, we, we can solve our problem by taking them off the street without having to kill them because the possibility is always there that you kill the wrong person like we've just in Texas experienced perhaps Cam Cameron Todd Willingham or uh, there was another one recently whose name has escaped me at the moment but a question as to whether or not he was actually innocent of the crime. But even if there are questions about the guilt of somebody after we've already executed them is way, way more than I would ever want to be responsible for. So. Um, I think that, and I hope that the death penalty in Texas is going to be gone. I want it gone. I think it's just awful. And I started this process in the early 80s not really being against the death penalty. Um, I think sometimes there are people who do things that are so bad and so against our world and and you I think you have to judge whether you are for or against the death penalty if you think well what would I do to that person who harmed my child or my husband or your wife you know can you look at that case objectively and say well let's just put him in a box for the rest of his life and that'll be okay with me probably not most people would say no I want him dead um, and, and so when I started this process, I, I thought that that was how I felt, you know, that, that there are people who do things so bad that they really deserve to die. They don't deserve to live and walk on the same earth that I walk on because I try to follow the law and live a good life and do things for other people. And I don't want somebody on in my space who does bad things to other people. But over the years, I have learned that that's, that's, that may be the way you feel emotionally, and that's okay to feel like that.